Pudi. Happy birthday. I guess a very special one. 65. A real milestone. Uh, so they say. So anyhow, um, I guess people who are watching this are wondering why I call you Pudi. Uh, but maybe you can relay that story to them. But it's meant for a very special group of friends. Your childhood friends. And um, speaking of childhood, um, I think we've had a very interesting journey together. And I think it started in 1964, Standard 3, um, when you came in to, from, or I guess, from Tanzania to Kenya. And we met at the Al Khan Primary School. Um, and since then, I think it's been a very interesting journey, which we've talked about many a time. So anyhow, um, I hope that continues. Uh, look forward to more conversations. And um, as we discuss the politics and other areas of interest we have in common. So I wish you all the best. And remember, the first trimester in your life, you learn. The next trimester in your life, you earn and bring your family, etc. And the third trimester in your life, you yearn. So this is your time to yearn. Enjoy yourself. Keep healthy. Have fun. And wish you all the best as you embark in your yearning years. Okay? All the best. But once again, happy birthday on this very special day. Take care, my friend. Talk soon. Pretty first of all, I want to wish you a very happy 65th birthday. Congratulations. This is fantastic news. You finally got there. <laughs> I'm going to read from my notes because I've got a few things I wanted to say to you. Well, first of all, you're now entitled to old age security. What a bonus. Now, I wonder if I should address you as Mze instead of Buana. And of course, Muse is the wise old man, not just old man. What do you think of that? You know, whether you're Buana or Muse, the one word that will always stick to you is Puti. And lately I've been thinking just how appropriate that word is, Puti. I think it's also a good acronym. And let me tell you why. In Kenya, you were a quiet student in primary school, studying incognito, but in turmoil. Of course, I didn't know that. But you were in turmoil because you did not want to be discovered by authorities. But you were putty. You were private, undocumented, Tanzanian, and illegal. When you immigrated to Canada, you worked hard in odd jobs as you studied furiously for your degrees. You were putty. You were persistent, underemployed, a Torontonian immigrant. Even when you organized the Aga Khan Primary School reunion in 2002, when you brought us, you and I, and many other classmates together, you were putty. Professional, undeterred, Tenacious is smiling. And when Ali Khan asked me to say a few words about our times together, all these years, I thought I'd reflect on our times together in primary school. And I remember and was, you know, as I look back on how we as students were engaged in extracurricular activities, and how passionate we were, I thought I'd maybe talk a little bit about that. These activities were completely optional and yet we were so enthusiastically involved. So we had debating, we had, uh, we learned French, we had word games during the lunch hour, a number of things. So in tribute to those times, I thought I'd write a limerick for you, Zaire. And, um, it goes something like this. I have a close friend called Zahir. His love of history has no peer. 
After he retired from work, he excelled in his study at York. Now teaching could be another career. So with that, I want to wish you a wonderful birthday today. I want to wish you and everyone in your family a most happy celebration. May you always have good health and much happiness. I designed a drink actually to toast to your future because I don't have sherbet with me, but I'm going to call it um, a drink that I designed just for you. And uh, most appropriately, I think it should be called the putty. Okay, so here's what's in my drink. I'm going to tell you the recipe. Nadia, are you listening? Okay. In a little jar, in a little jug, <laughs> a little cranberry juice with a little crushed ginger to represent the sour times in your life. A good measure of apricot nectar and fresh orange to remind you of the sweetness and love of family. A sliver of pineapple with a leaf or two of mint to represent the flavor and love of extended family and friends. And for good health, and it can't be called putty otherwise, a few prunes. Yes, all mosaics need a few prunes. Take care, have a great day, and Kushayu Barak. Yalman Zegir wishing you a very happy 65th birthday. And we wish you a healthy and prosperous life ahead. And inshallah, we'll be seeing you soon. Mukhi Sahib, Yasmin Bolati, Yasmin Bawa, Nekarim Bawa Sasatya, I wish Karuta a very, very happy birthday, a 65th birthday, and join us, the seniors, okay? Mulaji Badi Nekumet Puri Kare, and Mulaji Tandrusti Bayu Aishne, family may be some Salahet, a class Mohabacha Vadaro Kare, Mulaji Badi Badi Nekumedu Puri Kare, I call him Mulaji Bulu. Happy 65th birthday, Mukhi Sahib. Mola Badi, Umedani Puri Kare, Tandrus, Jivan De, and Gurme Abadi De, Suk De, and a Badi Mushkila San Kare, Iman Akridam Tak Salam Draki. Amen. All the best. Enjoy your senior years now. Hello, Ali. Happy birthday. Happy 65th birthday. And you're not 65, you're actually 18 with uh, 47 years of experience. So happy birthday, and Izmir is going to play a, a, a birthday song for you on the piano here. Here we go. So we wish you a very happy birthday. You're a true gentleman and a scholar, and hope you have a great day, and uh, hope you enjoy your Canada pension plan and old age security, and we need public sector pension reform. Yes, public sector pension reform. <laughs> okay, have a good day. Bye. Bye. Hey Ali, happy 65th birthday. My goodness me, where the time is gone? I just can't believe it. What a great present you are going to get on your 65th birthday. A grandkid and you're going to be dad of Apali. I just can't believe it. We pray for your health, happiness, peace, prosperity, very healthy, happy and long life and unity in the family. And bar bar ye din aaye, bar bar ye din aaye, tum jiyo hazaro saal, ye mere he arzu. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you, Ali. Hey, Ali. Happy 65th birthday. Amazing how the time has gone by. We remember picking you up from your high school in our yellow Volkswagen KKC 366 to spend the weekends with us in Nairobi, Kenya. And now, here we are, 65 years old. Congratulations, Ali. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. 
Happy birthday, dear Ali. Happy birthday to you. Hey Ali, happy birthday. Wishing you all the best on the big 6-5. Happy birthday from, from the Cossums. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Ali. Happy birthday to you. Hey, you made it to 65 and you don't even look it. Bravo! Join the club. May your life be filled with plenty of health, happiness and prosperity. May you enjoy your grandchildren and Gigi and share all the knowledge, wisdom of your life. May you have plenty of happy days ahead with your loved ones. Happy birthday, Ali. Cheers from Firoz Uncle and Dolly Auntie. Cheers! Happy birthday, Zahir. Happy 65th birthday. All the best. Again, welcome to the club. <laughs> the first thing you can go is uh, apply for a job with the Canada Revenue Agency. And maybe you can get your old age security in advance now at 65 if you haven't started already. Anyway, Zahir, happy birthday. Happy 65th birthday. May you have good health and uh, a lot of uh, success in your remainder of life. And may you fulfill all the dreams that you are pursuing. Happy birthday once again from all of us. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday. Happy, happy 65th birthday to my Sandy, my Baiji, Zahir. I would like to quote a reading I found. Life combined with health are the greatest gifts of all. Contentment is the greatest wealth and a trusted friend is the best relative. End quote. Yes, and welcome to the 2020s. And your 65th birthday, the year of wash your hands, sanitize, social distancing, and self-isolation. Cynthia and together with Alicia, Neil, and Sean also send best wishes for your 65th birthday and beyond. The era of rock and roll, a new decade without wars, the first decade of independence and partnership of India was the era you were born in. Yes, lives change for many of us. 2020 we will remember too, well, your birthday, Nanny's birthday, and the impending birth of our first granddaughter, Azuri. Stay well, my friend. Healthy. Enjoy the good golden years ahead as you continue to love life and pray to our one God. Cheers to your 65th birthday. You look after and happy 65th birthday, my friend. Stay well. Bye. Happy 65th birthday, Azair Uncle. What a massive milestone. We love you so much and are so proud of all of your accomplishments. I know for myself personally, my life would not be the same without you. Thank you for all the lessons that you've taught us. Thank you for always, you know, educating us, keeping us up to date on politics, on history, on making sure that we have the right values, even still the right morals into us, and you've just made every day brighter. Continue learning, continue being you. We love you very much, and we hope you enjoy your special day. 
Enjoy this milestone. You deserve it. And I can't wait to celebrate more with you in the upcoming years. Love you. Hey, Fua, we heard it was your birthday coming up. And from one York alumni to another. We just want to wish you a happy birthday. Happy birthday. Have a great one. In 1955, the inflation rate in the USA was 0.28%. Average cost of a new house was $10,950. Average yearly wage was $4,130. Minimum wage was a dollar per hour. Gas was 23 cents. Probably per g gallon. The first McDonald's was introduced. Coca-Cola was introduced in cans. Elvis Presley, the Comets, Chuck Berry all rose to popularity. The first edition of the Guinness Books of Records was published. And with all these great things, another great thing happened. Zaire Ali Darcy was, was introduced to the world. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Zaire. 65 years. Yay. Hi, Ali Ba. I wanted to wish you a happy 65th birthday. Happy birthday, Ali Ba. Um, from all of us, we just all want to quickly wish you a message. From myself, Amreen, Kaden, and Alina. Alina, you're first. What do you want to say to Fua? Come in the camera. Okay. Happy birthday, Fua. I love you. Okay, that's from Alina. Anything else? No. No, okay. All right. Kaden, what do you want to say? Hey, happy birthday, Fua. Um, I hope you have a great day and many more returns of the day. Amreen? Happy birthday, Aliba. We pray for you, that you will be safe and 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 that you will be safe. Inshallah, you will be safe and that you will be safe. Amen. Amen. Okay, now, Aliba, I'm going to finish off. Uh, though I haven't told everybody, it's your 65th birthday coming up. And we're all very, very happy. We all wish you prayers and good health and happiness on your birthday and always. But now, me being a pharmacist, I'm just going to quickly tell you, you've now officially become a senior citizen. So to let you know, the Ontario Drug Benefit will now cover your medications. That's firstly. And we have senior shopping hour, especially for people like you, 7 a.m. at all Walmarts. And one last thing, you've now officially reached the age where you can apply to become a greeter at Walmart. So just think about those things. So there's a lot of milestones here for your 65th birthday. But the main milestone is that you stay happy, healthy, safe. And of course, we love you and we hope and pray that you always stay healthy and live to be 100. Amen. I see. All right. Well, thank you, everybody, for joining us for our in-person and virtual meeting today. Uh, the topic of discussion is to discuss the significant activity of Zara Darcy's 65th birthday celebration. So it looks like we're missing a few people. Mm -hmm. I think uh, 10 a.m. coffee break may have gone over a little bit. But I think we'll continue without them. So, Ali, I'll turn it to you. Great. Thanks, Ange. Uh, yeah, I'll ask Azura just to make sure she uploads the meeting minutes to eSpace after this call. Um, just a reminder for everyone uh, attending that uh, today's conversation is just going to be in English. Uh, we sent the birthday wishes to the translation. I'm hoping for Dad's 75th birthday. They'll be fully complete. So it should be a quick turnaround this, this time. Only 10 years. Right. Well, uh, let's start with some blue sky thinking on the prudential risks of uh, celebrating the 65th birthday celebration. Yeah, excellent point, Ange. Uh, from an earnings, liquidity and capital perspective, I think we're in a very sound position. Uh, the only issue that I think we need to be aware of is from an operational risk uh, point of view. This pandemic is actually bringing about quite a few new risks that we just need to be on top of and make sure our institutions are aware of as well. Good point. So do we have a conclusion on next steps? Yeah, excellent point, Ange. Uh, so we're actually going to be forming a working group uh, and that'll be followed by some industry consult as well. Uh, and we just want to make sure that we have all buy-in from internal and external stakeholders. Um, and we'll also have to run the idea by our FISC partners. Uh, so once everyone's on side, it shouldn't be too long. I think we'll be able to have a concrete view formed by dad's 85th birthday. 
Sounds reasonable. Mm -hmm. um, as per the options presented, uh, I recommend that we proceed with uh, seeking approval uh, to go ahead with uh, quarantine birthday celebration mm. for Zara Darcy's 65th birthday. Fantastic. What do you think? I think that's an excellent recommendation, Ange. And if I might add, you put the exec and executive and the super and superintendent. <laughs> Am I right? Am I right? We've been in lockup for too long. Help us, please. Happy 65th birthday, Dad. Happy 65th birthday. Happy 65th birthday, Dad. This is a new chapter in your life. Called Grandparent. You have many, many more grandparenting years ahead. And we wish you all the best and many, many more years. Filled with good health, love, peace and happiness all right happy birthday dad happy birthday we love you wanted to wish you a very very happy 65th birthday may you be blessed with good health peace love and happiness always remember that 65 is only a number for you 65 is a new 35 and guess why I say that at 35 we started our family at 65 you will be starting your grandparenthood so enjoy those beautiful joyous years ahead with your grandchildren remember not everybody is blessed remember not everyone is blessed Count your blessings, think positive, think young. Next year, you won't be blowing your candles. Guess what? It's going to be our little princess blowing your candles for you. Enjoy, enjoy the rest of those many happy years together. Smile, think young, think positive and all the very, very, very best. Love you always. Take care. Hi Dad, wishing you a very happy 65th birthday. While every year is an important one, this one is even more so because it's celebrating milestones like building your life, your home, your family, and creating lots and lots of special memories worth noting for the history books. And this year is an even more special year, uh, 65 years and welcoming your first grandchild, which is so important to us, special to us and for the whole family. So thank you for always sharing your knowledge, your wisdom, your experiences with us, because that's something that uh, we take uh, very, very seriously and uh, we're very, very grateful for. So just wanted to wish you on your 65th birthday, uh, health, love, happiness, uh, more memories uh, and bonding over our history with uh, the Federal Public Service. Happy 65th birthday, Dad. Hi, Dad. Happy 65th birthday. This is a milestone birthday and we're extremely proud of you for reaching this mark. This is obviously a very strange year because of the pandemic, but it shouldn't take away from how important this milestone is in your life. You always take lessons to teach us. <clears throat> you always take time, sorry, to teach us lessons, send us articles. And you're also extremely knowledgeable in all aspects of life, including careers, the world, history, and many other topics. I've always appreciated our chats, even though I don't always tell you that. And I definitely appreciate them now, uh, especially because we have so much in common since we're both accountants. We've both been bank regulators and we're both soon, I'm soon to be father. So that's something else we'll have in common. Um, and I'll definitely have some big shoes to fill uh, following your footsteps. So. Uh, happy birthday, Dad. Um, may this be a year full of good health, happiness, and lots of memories with your granddaughter. Enjoy these years and all the fun that it's going to bring. And just remember to make 65 the new 56. Or something like that. It doesn't really work with 65, but you know what I mean. Happy birthday, Dad.